A big story there, but right now at midday, another big story is the weather. Wildfires in Canada are impacting air quality across the East Coast, including right here in Hampton Roads. Good afternoon. I'm Aisha Tolliver. And I'm Bianca Holman. Thanks for joining us. So right now you're looking at the latest video from the area. Officials say forest fires in Ontario and Quebec continue to burn out of control. Thousands of people have been forced from their homes, and the smoke is putting a haze in the air all the way down here to Hampton Road. So let's send things over to meteorologist Steve Fundera live outside on patio 10 with more on the condition. Steve. Yeah, Bianca Asia, you step outside today and skies seem bright. Seems like we'd have a lot of sunshine, but you look up and it, it, the sky's not as blue as it would be on a day as clear as today. Smoke is really uh, blanketing many across the Northeast, the mid Atlantic up the I-995 corridor and around parts of town. Air quality is starting to take a hit here or there. Nothing too bad or as dramatic as what is uh, uh, dealing or is what is dealt up towards the north. So let's take a look outside across Hampton Roads. We're really dealing with OK air quality, but further in parts of Elizabeth City, a Hosky. See those little orange dots there in some of our air quality sensors. That means it's unhealthy for some, specifically those who are very sensitive to larger particulates in the air, like wildfire smoke. Uh, you may see some issues if you have severe asthma or uh, uh, things like that. That's when you want to limit your activity outside uh, and uh, essentially maybe not open up the windows. But further to the north, take a look at all those red dots up there. That's where the air quality is taking a bigger hit. That may drift further to the south as we progress into tomorrow because we're going to have a breeze more so out of the north northeast, which could pull in some additional smoke. All the smoke on the satellite picture here, you could see it drifting from north to south. The brighter whites on the satellite picture, those are our clouds everywhere else in between that faint gray. That's the fire. That's the wildfire smoke that is rather. So we're going to see this continued push from north to south, kind of blanketing the mid Atlantic, the northeast. For us here tomorrow, it could get a little thicker. You may notice a little scent of, say, campfire, so to speak, out and about if you're around uh, out and about later today and tomorrow. All in all, though, weather today is really nice. And in fact, it's real warm. We're already getting spots into the 80s. The sun is still strong. So while the sky may not seem totally blue, uh, the UV index is elevated for sure. As we go into tomorrow, we do have a front nearby and we'll throw us a couple showers around. We'll detail that in your future check forecast coming up in just a little bit. Asia, beyond. Okay. All right, Steve, thank you very much. And remember, we're on your side, making it easier to get the free wavy weather app for your smartphone and tablet. Just take a picture of the QR code right there on your screen and the app will automatically pop up for you. Once you have it, be sure to turn on those weather alerts. You'll also get the hour by hour forecast, live radar and access to our weather blogs.